hello again it's my January favorites video and I've never done one of these before so this is my first ever favorites video and I just want to say thank you very much if you commented yesterday I put a video on it was the get to know me tag and I asked at the end was it okay to do a January favorites even though it's the 6th of February and you all said yes it's absolutely fine so thank you for doing that I don't know all the rules you see of these videos so yeah cheers for replying right so I'm going to get straight into it and show you my January favorites some of the products um if you've watched some of the hauls are thing items from them that I've loved so I'm bringing them back to show you how good they are other things are uh, sort of some bedding that I found in Asda and I'm going to show you that and yeah just things that I love everyday items that I couldn't live without basically oh and I've got more makeup on today so I'm <laughs> which I'll explain like one of my favorites is the lipstick and I was using that that's one of the Poundland ones and I put some eyeshadow on I might I should have maybe blended it a bit more but um Anyway, this will do for now. Right, so I'm going to get straight into it. I was playing around with this. Um, I'm going to be using this at my gig. So I, I wear quite a lot of makeup when I'm on stage. I'm, I'm a singer. You might have seen that yesterday in the video. But anyway, if you want to get to know me and find out a bit more about me, watch yesterday's video and that will explain wh what I'm about and what I do and stuff. So this is brilliant. This was from Poundland. I got this in my first ever Poundland haul that I did. Well, it's my second one. I did a not proper one in December, but the one I did in January, which did really well, I did the proper thumbnail for. Um, this is from that, and I was delighted. I was like super, so excited. This could have been one of the reasons why I did a Poundland haul, because I was like, I've just got to show everyone this that I got for a pound. So that's, you know, you could be the reason why I started. My friend Louise and you and then uh, I love YouTube, so thank you, and, and my friend Louise. Right, so back to this, it's a pound, and I've been using it today, um, and my gigs, I start back, it's kind of, I sing, sing in holiday parks, and the season starts again this weekend, um, and I'm gonna be using quite a lot of these colors, I absolutely love them, so that's a pound, it's a Maybelline, the Rock Nudes, a pound, I was absolutely chuffed, so I've got it on now, I've got quite a lot of um, Poundland makeup on actually, right, so that's that, that's my first favourite, another item is from Poundland, again, it's a Poundland own brand nail varnish, uh, I did um, show this in a different Poundland haul, it's really, really good, so I'm, I'm really pleased with that, and I've, I've just put it on now, oh, still, my burn hasn't gone down, I burnt myself on that lantern thing, anyway, so that is great, that's another one of my favourites, and bedding, right? So this is um, from Asda, but I love anything with stars. Um, and these are white and gray and they're for this room. And I think they are f brushed cotton. So, oh, you dropped it. And they're really, really soft. Uh, so I really like the feel of this when you get into bed on brushed cotton. I don't like it when it gets static, you know, and it goes a bit funny. So hopefully it'll wash um, quite nicely. As I don't like it when it goes cotton woolly. Uh, it makes me feel a bit weird but yeah this is a fitted sheet um from asda i think that was nine pounds i could be wrong and I, I don't know how much these were but they weren't mega expensive so i'm pleased with them and you get a little bag like this little bag i didn't even know that how sweet is that so a little bag that holds them with a bit of elastic nicker elastic not nicker elastic um <laughs> And you get another little bag here. So, so I'm pleased with those. Uh, they're my bedding, my favourite bedding of January. I'm going to save my favourite favourite for the end. But you have to let me know what your favourite favourite is of my January favourites. I really love these. Okay, they're also from Asda. I did um, like a home delivery thing. And I was just looking for copper things and marble. And these are two baskets and they're six quid. And I did see them in Primark, but I think, I could be wrong, it was five pounds for one. But here you get two little baskets. Oh, they're attached because I haven't used them yet. Oh, I haven't finished doing this this room how I want it, so I'm just leaving them as they are. But six pounds for two copper wire baskets, and I'm really pleased with these. And also, I'm going to do a copper and marble home haul because I know everyone loves it at the minute. I also love it too. And this room that I'm, um, this is like the spare room, girly bedroom where I get ready. I'm going to make it really beautiful with marble and um, copper and black and grey. So once it's all finished, which it nearly is, mind you, the um, carpenter had to take the door off one of the fitted wardrobes because it, it went wonky. It bowed it dead. So he's taken that off. So that looks really ugly. But one day I will show you this room in all its glory. I promise. Ah! Oh! I thought I just broke my favourite favourite then. <gasps> that wouldn't have been a good thing. That wouldn't have been a favourite thing to do. I didn't break my favourite favourite, nearly did. Oh, I'd be so upset if I broke my favourite favourite. Right, trousers. I think I said I, I love these trousers that are kind of 
as comfy as pyjamas, but you can actually wear them out. They're like, are they called Harlem? No. Like um, MC Hammer pants, but not, not as baggy as MC Hammer pants. There is a word for it. What is it? Is it Harlem pants? Oh, I don't know. You know, baggy trouser pyjama out going out bottoms. These are from Next and they are oh, 22 quid. You know, you can't always get a bargain. If you like something, you've kind of got to pay full price. But I can't wait to wear these when the weather gets warmer. It's been snowing today. It was snowing in Great Yarmouth. It was very pretty. It's all melted now. But um, yeah, so I can't wear these just yet. So I cannot wait to wear these in the spring when it's a bit warmer. And they're just really, I like this grey and like dusky pink and little flowery pattern. So I'm pleased with those. They are my, one of my favourites. Also, what have I got here from Poundland? He's been in quite a few videos because he just popped up because he likes talking. The French Bulldog. And I've, I have got this in white, but the grey one's my favourite. You are my favourite of all the pugs. Don't tell the others. But yeah, he was, he was in the first Poundland haul. Was it the second one? Oh, I don't know. But yeah, I really love him. So I'll put him back there. Oh, this was from um, the charity shop haul that I did a couple of weeks ago. I love it. My mum has tried to steal this off me. I'm just going to get my glasses and show you with the glasses on it. Because actually, sorry, I'm still chatting. When I um, did showed you this before, I put it on wrong. I put the glass, I, went, I put it like this. And that's silly. That's not proper. I was uh, I was told, like, you have to put them so then it goes over the nose. So thank you very much if that was you that commented and said... Um, put them on the right way because I never I would have got it wrong forever so this is I love this it's two quid and this makes me happy it just looks funny and I always use my glasses so when I run down in the morning to get them to to um, take Toby to school they're always on this little fellow so yeah I'm pleased with that for two pounds so you're my favorite from the charity shops I think what else have I got here oh yeah this um from Poundland you might have seen that in a different haul you might have seen it in Poundland Oh, the bat oh no, it is working. It's just bright in here. I've put this downstairs. I was going to give it to Toby, but he's got quite a few um, night lights. And I've just put this in our living room. And it actually looks really sweet. So I like some candles and pop this on. And I really like it. It was only two quid. And this is one, one of my favourite things. It looks really cute. So yeah, I love that. You might have noticed, or you might not have noticed, but there's an addition to the YouTube table. Uh, it's this reed diffuser. This is the Poundland one and it's really good okay so i've got a few other reed diffusers dotted about i've got some for christmas as i've not really bought them before i tend to just light candles or just smell the house smells uh i didn't realize this was so good um so i love this this is obviously from poundland exotic mango i can't remember if this was the one i got but the smells are really nice it's like the new range so if you were thinking of getting this, uh, it's really, really good. Honestly, every time you walk into the room, it smells lovely. So I'm really impressed with my Poundland Reed Diffuser. And my favourite smell of this um, new range is the Exotic Mango. So yeah, I've got another one of those. I might have to stock up. Honestly, they're great. I can smell that from here. It's really, really nice. I got quite a few of these um, lipsticks from Poundland. They're Maybelline Superstay 14 Lipstick Megawatt. This, I've got it on now, and I really like the colour. And I don't think a lot of lipsticks suit me. Um, that's why I tend to go for more lip balms with a tint. But this is really, really nice. This is Burst of Coral. And I got a few, I've got about three or four of these, I think, which I'm, I'm really glad I stocked up. These two are favourites that I use every day, and I absolutely love this lip balm. I don't know if you watched the Home Bargains haul that I did. And this is, these are $1.99. Honestly, the best lip balm I've ever found in my life. And I just really hope they um, never stop selling them because I love it and this is an eyeliner that I use nearly every day as well it's just a collection 2000 cheeky one extreme bold it's like you know one of those felt tip ones so I just do my little ticks on my eyes I'm not brilliant at makeup but this is just easy and I just this took me about I don't know a minute just to and it was done so I'm quite quick with my makeup uh, so this I don't know how much these cost but it's um like it's an angled brush like it's wide and then it goes thin and I didn't realize I thought it was just like a pen but actually these are better so if you're going to get one of these get one with um the angled -y bit with the wider and the thinner bit don't know what the technical name is oh I've got a lovely candle a couple of candles actually uh this is from a shop called Latham's in Norfolk and I think these were 6 99 and I got this and I didn't realize how beautiful it was when you light it it's like a, a three candle candle it smells gorgeous and when I light it it um it glows through so it makes a really nice sort of copper glow and I love it I got two of these I wish I got more but I didn't realize how nice they were at the time 
You might have seen these in the Home Bargains haul as well, the candle wick candles. I got around to using it um, and it's lovely. It smells really nice. I think, because that's sat next to this downstairs and of the two, I can smell this more than I can than I can smell this, but um, it's still really nice. And it doesn't really crackle though. I've not used the wood wick ones. They're the more expensive ones, but this is sort of, it's got a long wick. Um, it does make a noise, but you have to kind of, no, you don't do that because your hair will set on fire. You have to kind of go up close. Like, you know, when you have a seashell and you listen, you have to do that. So when you've got the telly on, you can't hear the crackling, but I like the shape. I love the color. It's a nice smell. And they were only 6.99, I think, or 5.99 from Home Bargains. It's got a really nice lid as well. So that is one of my favorites. It looks really pretty. On, on the little table in the living room. Another thing from Home Bargains is this moisturiser, Youthful Vitality Spa Experience. It smells lovely, it's a really nice product. It was £1.49 and I get really dry skin and, and that's been lovely actually, so I'm, I'm pleased with my Dove. I love a notebook, these are my favourite ones I got. I think I got this, this is from Poundland, and I got, there was this heart one and one that said goals and I think I bought them in every single size because they're just so lovely. So that's one of the notebooks. And then I went to the works the other day in Great Yard and I found this notepad. I actually found loads of things from the work, so I might do a separate stationery haul. I, there was just so many lovely notepads and cards and all sorts and books and audio books. So I just wanted to show you this little one that was one pound fifty. It's just so pretty. So I shall use this, and it's got you know a little bit of string, so you can if you're writing in a page, you can just go straight to it, can't you? So that's quite handy. So yes, I love that. Isn't that just so pretty? You can't not buy things like this. I live in pyjamas, pyjamas are my favourite thing. I'll do the school run, come back and literally get into pyjamas and I would be in pyjamas every single day, all day, if I didn't have to go out. And I got quite a few from Peacocks. Um, I don't know if you've seen these pink and stars. I got a load of these in the sale, I think. I actually don't know if they were in the sale. I got them just after Christmas and they arrived in January and I've got all different colours, like a grey stripe, uh, pink stars and I think a red, red ones I wore. I don't know if you watched my parody song, Big Bowls, but I've got some red pyjamas on from Peacocks and I love those as well. So yes, loving uh, these pyjamas and they're nice and soft and they're not um, too tight. I hate it when pyjamas are too tight and these are perfect and they're cuffed. I love a cuffed pyjama. I also really love this from the Primark haul. It was two pounds and this is gonna be my car boot sale money. I'm gonna put that in my bag and it was reduced from four pounds. So that's my favorite things that I got from Primark the other day. Oh, that's February. <gasps> it's a February favorite. What am I gonna do, is that wrong? Oh no, you were bought in February, I'll have to leave you to the next one. Or maybe he can feature twice. Now it's time for my favorite favorite. I love it so much, look. It's kind of see-through as well, you can, you can see me through it, look. How cute is that? I just love it, it's from The Range, which is in Norwich. Um, I've never been to The Range before, it was amazing. I've got so many lights from there. Um, so I might do, when I do my marble and copper haul, I'll show you the lights, I've got some really nice lights. Um, but anyway, yeah, I love this so much. This was 4 99 so it wasn't like mega cheap, but it's just so beautiful. Um, this is the Make Lace, Cambridge Lace, English by Design. I'm just gonna have to really be careful with it because it's so thin and fine, but oh, I love it. I'm gonna have a cup of tea of that in a minute and then um, look after it and not let anybody else get their grabby mitts on it because it's my special one. This is my favourite favourite, the, um, not foot bottom, footed mug. That's the one, isn't it? So yeah, I love this, love this shape. I don't know if you ever watched Nashville. Um, I love Nashville and Raina James, who was like the, the main lady, she always drank in the most amazing footed mugs and I always wanted them. So since I watched Nashville, I'm like, I need to find Raina James's footed mugs. So that's all my favourite things. I've also loved listening to Radio 1 this month um, to Chris, uh, Scott Mills and Chris. They're on from one till four o'clock. They are so funny. It's just like listening to a couple of mates. I love listening to them. So that's my favourite uh, radio station, favourite. When I go to pick up Toby, that's my favourite thing to listen to. TV wise, I've not, mm, I've not found any box sets I've loved. I'm waiting for Game of Thrones to start, Walking Dead. I do love those, but uh, I need a new box set, like on Netflix. I've started to watch Stranger Things, so I need to get back to Stranger Things. But is there anything else? 
if you can recommend any box sets on Netflix or, you know, I can get off the iPlayer or something, let me know. So thank you very much for watching yet again. I really appreciate it if you've come back to watch this video. Hello if you've just subscribed or hello if you want to subscribe or hello if you don't want to. But if you did, that would make me happy. Like the video if you want to and send me a comment. Let me know your favourite favourite that I showed you. And yeah, thank you very much indeed. I'll get another video together for Thursday, a Pound World haul. And I've got loads more to do. I've got things to show you and I'm really excited about the copper and marble hall. I don't know if anyone else would be excited but that excites me. So thanks for watching and I'll see you later. Thank you. Bye. We can't forget this favourite favourite Rufus the dog who's been on YouTube quite a lot haven't you? Being very nice. Not like Bestie the crazy cat who, who is lovely most of the time. Just crazy in this room but yeah. Love you Rufus. You've been very popular. People think you're very cute. Are you enjoying being on, on YouTube? Is it fun? Yeah, good boy. Yeah, he's off. He's bored. All right.